Hi, I'm Natalie from Purely Juicers. This is a product demonstration for the Samson 9001 juicer, which is one of my favorite juicers. I like it because it's still a very healthy juicer, but it's extremely practical and versatile. You'll see what I mean. If you order a juicer, this juicer from us, it'll come in this box exactly with all of these different parts. You have the manual, the two different jugs, one for juice and one for pulp a sieve in case you want to strain out pulp, you've got the juicing chamber, the hopper, the auger which is the part that's going to chew up your fruit, there's just a little pusher, a brush to help you clean out the screens, um, it comes with two different cones that has a juicing screen and a mincing cone, a bunch of different nozzles for juicing, mincing and different pasta and noodle options, your juicing chamber cover, and the juicer itself. One of the reasons I find this juicer to be so practical is because of its extremely easy assembly and disassembly process. I'm going to demonstrate the assembly and disassembly for regular juicing with, of fruits and vegetables. All you have to do is take your chamber, slide it in there, and twist this to the fasten position. Grab your ogre, push it in all the way, Take your juicing cone, put it in that way, the lid, twist it to close, take the right nozzle, oops, twist it on, add the hopper, and you're done. How long did that take? Maybe 30 seconds? That's pretty practical. The Samson 9001 is an extremely versatile juicer. Not only can it juice all different types of fruits, vegetables, and leafy greens, you can also use it for mincing meats, fish, herbs, or garlic. You can use it to grind things like coffee beans, spices, grains, flour, or you can also use it to homogenize things, or you can make pastas or rice cakes and rice noodles with it. It's really easy to use for all of those things, and it's extremely great at juicing too, so it makes it a great machine to have at home to use in your kitchen. Most people do buy juicers to use them as juicers though, so that's why I'm going to demonstrate how well it can juice different types of fruits and vegetables with this juice recipe. I chose this recipe because it has lots of different types of fruits and vegetables and it has two different soft fruits. You have peaches and tomatoes. I just wanted to demonstrate how well the Samson 9001 can handle soft fruits like that because tons of different types of juicers, like centrifugal juicers, or even other mastication juicers, often have difficulty juicing soft fruits or leafy greens, and I wanted to show you. I'm going to put them all in. You'll see. It's going to handle it all. Do it really quickly, and we'll have juice within a few minutes. So, I cut up one peach, one tomato, one carrot, and a handful of spinach. All I'm going to do is turn my juicer on, and start pouring them in. A little bit of peach. With most juicers, it's a good idea to mix your soft fruit with your hard fruits to make it easier. But with the Samson, it doesn't really matter. However, it is always a good idea. So all I'm doing is feeding it through one at a time. You can see the pulp coming out right there. And you'll notice how quickly this juicer actually juices the fruits. Lots of mastication juicers have a rather slow juicing process itself because they'd like to operate at slow speeds, but the Samson can still push fruit through the juicer relatively quickly, and it's still only 80 RPMs, which makes extremely healthy juice. I just poured my juice in this glass and I'm going to give it a try. Mmm, delicious.
delicious. One of the reasons people are reluctant to get masticating juicers is because the parts can't go in the dishwasher and they don't feel like spending 10 or 15 minutes taking it all apart and giving it a clean after every juice. They just don't have time for that. Well, the Samson 9001 juicer can honestly be disassembled and cleaned in under two minutes. It's that easy. I think it's even easier than putting things into the dishwasher. I'm going to show you how it works. All you do is grab your jacks, start rinsing, and twist the chamber, and start rinsing all that. You take this apart, a little high, twist off your top, clean out there, rinse through here. You want to pull the screen out, let it rinse, pull out the chamber. So you're going to, now you're just clean. Juicing chamber is clean. And my brush here, pop any pulp out of the seed. All you have to do is scrub out the screen and really just rinse at everything else, and you'll be done. The screen is clean. Rinse through these. Did that seem hard?